Hi everyone, I'm Coach Clender. I'm gonna be doing a tour of the boathouse today. So right now we're standing um, on what we call the big UCF. And right up this way is our front gate. So the girls usually drive in and park around the little pond. And then I'll go ahead and take you guys inside the Ergram and show. So I'm gonna go ahead and take you inside as if we were walking into the locker room. So right here we have our trophies and all of our team conference um, pictures up here on the wall. We also have our gear room where the girls have all their Nike stuff so they get buckets with their names on it that have everything in it. We have our food room. So right now because of COVID, we're actually only allowed to do grab and go snacks, but usually typically we have bagels and stuff to make sandwiches and smoothies and all that kind of good stuff in here. And then we also have athletic training stuff and our ice machine. And now we'll go ahead and take you into the locker room. So here we have the locker room. When we first walk in, the girls have their countdown board so they know how many days until each race. This is usually an announcement board, but also because of COVID, we can't use the locker room right now. So the girls have all their lockers on these side. And then we have missing sock and their girls' birthday calendar. And then we also have a chalk wall and more lockers on this side. So this is one of my favorite parts of the boathouse is uh, the chalk wall. So the girls will pick a word that they wanted to embody this year and they went ahead and wrote it on the board so that everyone could see it. And then every year, because it is a chalk wall, we just wipe it and erase it. And then that team for that year gets to make the new board. And then back here, we have all the showers. And then we also have the rest of the bathrooms back here. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take you out um, to the erg room. So we're walking back out of the locker room and right here, we actually have one of our food tables that the girls have been using just because um, everything has to be spaced out from COVID. Up here, we have all of our first team and second team, all conference winners. Also, we have some more trophies up here. Um, the girls also get their laundry done. So we put their clean laundry loops on this table. And here we are in the erg room. So usually all the ergs are spread out. Uh, we're rowing outside right now. Um, and when we do erg, we erg outside on the patio in the UCF. So we have erg bikes, all of our ergs, some decoration stuff up here. And we actually have all of the country flags of the entire team's countries, home countries, which is sort of a fun thing for them. And then right here, we have the coxswain room, which the coxswains are all sorted by colors. So they have all their speed coaches and cox boxes, boat lights, all that kind of good stuff. And then in here, we have the coaches offices, which is just sort of our conference room where we meet in the morning to go over practice plans. And then we have our team swords. We do athlete of the week and they get to sign the board. And then we have our UCF record board. This is sort of a fun thing that we've started since COVID was we asked the question um, of the day. So would you rather or all kinds of different questions and the girls have a magnet and then they get to pick which one is theirs and it's kind of fun to see what they have at the end of the day. Um, coaches locker room, back bathrooms, stuff to foam roll heat um, in the morning, some more ergs. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take you outside. All right, so this big building over there, that's where we store all of our boats. I'm gonna go ahead and take you down to the lake first. So right here we have the patio and then we have our viewing area for all of our spectators to watch and now I'm going to go ahead and take you down to the dock. As you can see I'm down here on the dock we have some of our launches we have a few neighbors that live on the lake as well so how it kind of works is we row in a circle around the lake it's about 5,000 meters around and then there's some big buoys here at the bottom. That's our finish line. And then we have a six laned buoyed course all the way up to the top of the lake, which is a full 2K. So this is our lake and we're very blessed that we're on a private lake because it's super quiet and there's not a ton of boat traffic. So it's really just us out there in the morning. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take you up to show you all the boats.
So now I'm in the first boat bay and we have all of our singles. We have a ton of weight equipment. It's super nice to have all of this stuff at the boathouse as well in case you know, we wanted to switch up practices or something like that. We're able to do everything that we need to do at the boathouse. Um, and then in the back there, we have our washers and dryers. So we actually have a manager that helps us get all the girls' laundry washed every day. And then if I walk over here into this bay, um, these are some of our older shells up here. And we actually just got a new boat. It doesn't have a name yet, but this is our new Hudson, our new V8 racing shell. And right here we have all of our conference banners. All of our oars are on the outside of every rack. And then in here we have all of our fours. And then our conference banners are up here. More of our oars. And then we have some more pairs and singles on this side um, with the rest of our big eights over here. And then we have all of our NCAA banners up here as well. So then if I were to take you out of the boathouse, we would be right back here on the grass so we could walk down to the dock or we could go to the erg room or we could get in our car and head out and back to campus. Thank you so much for watching our video. We hope you love it. Um, UCF is definitely a super unique and fun place to be. So if you have any questions or have anything that you'd like to know about UCF, please reach out to one of the coaches and we'd be happy to talk with you. Thank you.